Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Warrior Bats. We are currently playing with the Rose Clan. Oh my goodness. And we have this beautiful, interesting little nicheling who had wandered into our tribe with this very interesting scorpion tail. And I think that there may be some romance in the air. I think that little Fuzzy Heart is thinking about a mate of his own. Since his little sister has already had one child and is currently pregnant, little Bee Heart, I think Fuzzy Heart would want some mate of his own. And uh, there's not really uh, too many mates. I mean, I guess if maybe he wants to go with one of his sisters, I don't know. I think he would be interested in Dapple, though. However, we're having a food epidemic. <laughs> we need more food, okay? We're hungry. We're hungry, hungry hippos, and we need to get some more food in our tribe stat. So I think everyone is going to be um, on the mission to gather and hunt. However, if we do hunt, we have to be careful because this defender bear will attack anything that starts attacking. So in the last episode, this defender bear actually killed one of the burinas that were attacking us. But I'm scared if we attack anything else that the defender bear will start attacking us. And that would be very, very bad. Uh, we also have this friendly bearina in our tribe who I think um, maybe one of our nichelings, maybe Honeycat, would be very interested in potentially breeding with this bearina in the future. And maybe we can add some of the bearina characteristics to our tribe. I'm not too sure. And speaking of Honey Kit, you are now an adult. So we can go ahead and change your name to Honey Paw uh, for a little bit while we figure out what we should actually name you in the future. Uh, but first things first, we need food. We need food before we can have any more babies, before we can add any members to our tribe. We're hungry. So we have been feeding on some of these pick prickly berries, and it seems to be okay with the purse knot ability. It seems like our nichelings are able to heal pretty fast from it. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and continue doing that. And then we also have this termite nest. So let's go ahead and have thorn, thorn star like whack that open. And then wing flight. Oh no, are you going to be able to get over here? Let's see, thorn star. Let us go ahead. And do we have any food over here? I'm not sure. Hmm, thorn star, let's go ahead and have you do a purr. Just so you can help heal anything that's going on. Let's go ahead and move you over here so you can start clearing up this. And let's go ahead and have Fuzzy Heart pick up some of these berries. And then Spruce Cat, you can go ahead and collect the berries that are right over there. And there is a bird. <gasps> There's a bird flying around. We're going to have to be extra, extra careful uh, with that. And then Honey Paw... Let us see. I kind of want to find more berry bushes. Do we know where anything else is? Let's see. It doesn't look like it. We might have to explore more this way then. Uh, we, yeah, we might have to do that because <laughs> we need some more food options, but we're not too sure what to do. I don't really want to move uh, Roseberry too far because she is currently very, very old. She only has four days left in her life and I'm still debating in my head if Roseberry and Thornstar should have another kit of their own. And once Thornstar passes away, we're gonna have to think about who we want our next leader of our tribe to be. Is it going to be Wingflight? Are we gonna change his name to Wingstar? Or maybe F Fuzzy Heart should be the next leader. Hmm. Or maybe Bee Heart. Should we change to be star? Hmm, these are many things that we need to think about. Uh, but like I said, first things first, we are desperately in the need of f to collect food. Uh, let's go ahead and see, can we move Fuzzy Heart over here? And then can we move Wing Heart to collect, a uh, Wing Flight to collect these bugs? We're so hungry right now. Um, there we go. And let's go ahead and move Roseberry. She can help collect around here and see if we can find anything else. And then looks like Bladehorn Kit. You have two moves. Let's go ahead and have you kind of explore this way a little bit to see what we can find. 
And then I think we're ready. And I'm thinking, I think our Barina is actually attacking wing flight. I'm not sure what's going on with that. But he's not taking any damage because of the purr ability that we have. Uh, and I wonder if that means that the Defender Bear is going to kill him. I don't even know. But let's go ahead and see what the next day brings. And okay, so it doesn't look like he attacked him. But it looks like the Defender Bear might be chasing away our little Barina friend. Hmm. <laughs> Very interesting. So I wonder if uh, little, let's see, Honey, where is Honey at? She would probably be like, hey, there's Honey. Okay, Honey is over there. I think she might, because I don't, I think the Defender Bear is chasing our Barina. I think Honey Paw, in case this Barina dies, would be like, hey, Let's have a baby. Let's become mates. <laughs> or maybe this Baryon is trying to tell us that there's food over here. <gasps> Wait, is there food over there? Maybe. Maybe we should go ahead and cross over this little river and search for more food. Hmm. So Thornstar, do we want to have another mate? Oh, we're so low on food. I don't think we can do it. I don't think we can. I don't know. Let's see, they only have three days left. I don't think they'll be able to. We are in desperate need of food. Desperately. Uh, let's go ahead and have uh, Roseberry follow over here. Oh, great! A berry bush. Okay, we can go ahead and collect those berries. So that is awesome. There is a little berry bush over there. And then little blade horn. Let's go ahead and collect some of the grasses around this area. And then bee heart, you can go ahead and collect these berries. Um, over here and then wing flight you need some assistance well, let's go ahead and have spruce quick collect those berries and then fuzzy heart move over here go ahead and like wing flight and then wing flight you can go ahead and collect these bugs perfect and then I guess you can lick them again <laughs> oh my goodness all right so we're getting 20 food now we have a little bit more uh, wing flight you have another ability can you go ahead and do anything with that no. Alright, and then is this Defender Bear chasing our Barina? I think so. I think so. Oh my goodness. Are you gonna get damaged? Poor little guy. At least Honeypaw is carrying this little Barina's child in case anything happens. Alright, so Roseberry. Let's go ahead and collect these. I think she'd be very excited. And then let's go ahead and have Thornstar. Oh my goodness, two days left. Two days. Oh my goodness. I want them to kind of have another child. <gasps> I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. We have to. We just have to, okay? It's it's Roseberry and Thornstar. They need to have at least one more baby. They have to. Oh my goodness. And we really need to go ahead and get some more food. So little blade horn, can you help us get some of these berries? Little one. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it doesn't seem to really hurt them. So I'm pretty happy about that. And okay, so let's go ahead and get some more. Get some of those and go ahead and clear up some of these grasses. And let's go ahead and have wing flight. Is there any more bugs over here? There isn't. Nora berries here. A uh, fuzzy heart. Why don't you come over to this side and see if you can find any more berry bushes that are over on this side? And ooh, there's a healing plant there. And then is there anything else? There's another termite mound, which Wing Flight can kind of help us get along with Blade Horn uh, once he's older. And then let's see what else do we have? Wing Flight. Uh, why don't you come over here and see what this Defender Bear is doing? <laughs> Oh my goodness, are you gonna kill our Barina friend? He's a friendly Barina. Oh my goodness. And then Honeypaw, I think, would be very concerned about making sure that there's enough food for our tribe as well. And would come over to this side of our land in and search for more berry bushes. Uh, and I don't see any. Because <laughs> uh, she really wants to have her child too, especially since she doesn't know what's gonna happen to our Barina friend. All right, so we have a lot of pregnant nichelings and not a lot of food. And, oh my goodness, did you get hit? Not yet, I guess you're just being chased by the Defender Bear. 
And then it looks like Dapple really wants to join our tribe and have a baby of her own. She's just like sitting in this nest. She's like, I'm ready. Uh, but not right now. Actually, you're in our nest. Rosemary could have used that. It's her last day. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Hashtag Thornstar and Roseberry. Forever loved. Uh, let's just go ahead and place a nest right there. Oh, I guess there's a nest there now. It's okay. Everything's fine. Let's go ahead and collect these berries. Oh my goodness. Roseberry. You're gonna have your last little baby. Oh, so cute. And then let's go ahead and clear up some of this area. And then Fuzzy Heart. Why don't you come out this way to see if we can find any food? Uh, there's more termite mounds. And then... Honey Paw, why don't you go ahead and continue on with your brother? There's that termite mine there. Hmm. <laughs> and then, oh, it looks like this one is ready now. Is this one... Okay, so now it's green now, so I guess it won't damage us as much. Or at all. Alright, so Wing Flight... You need to come back over here uh, so you can collect these bugs and then spruce kit. Why don't you go ahead and whack that up? And then you can collect the bugs that are right there. All right. And then there was like this little thing. We need rain. <gasps> That's what's happening. We need rain. All of our berry bushes are drying up because we don't have enough rain. We don't have enough food. Oh my goodness. And let's go ahead and collect over here. And then Spruce Cat, you can come pop over here and help with this bush once we get more. And then Bee Heart. Hmm. <laughs> Why don't you come over to this bush and wait for it to come and get some more berries too? Oh my goodness. We need food and blade horn. Uh, let's go ahead and collect that. And then we're out of moves. Oh my goodness. <gasps> I'm gonna miss Roseberry and Thornstar so much. Our two starter nichelings, our two star-crossed lovers, who decided to run away together and start a clan of their own. And they found this little nicheling who looked a little bit different. His little person out didn't look quite right, and he had a wing, but they decided to allow him to join their clan. And now, look at all their children that they had, and their children are starting to have children. Oh my goodness. They're going to leave behind one last little one. <gasps> oh no! They're gone! Poppy! Little Poppy, a little boy, is left alone in this world. She has, or he has, the purse out. Let's see, he does carry the spiky body in his recessive trait and has two runner legs oh my goodness i'm so sad they're gone so we have a little baby over here a little poppy uh let's go ahead let's see poppy i kind of want to change your name yeah let's change your name to oak and then we'll put kit at the end little oak kit <laughs> little oak kit there you are little one because poppy seems like a, a female name to me it, it's probably not, but I don't know. It just seems like that to me. Uh, but you're currently all alone. So I think Beeheart, with her little pregnant belly, would come run over here to make sure that um, her little brother is going to be okay in this world all alone. So she will come and rest right over there. And then we have our little explorers right now who are exploring this area on the hunt for more food. And oh, there's more berry bushes there. That's perfect, because we need it so bad. All right, so Honey Paw. Oh, they're toxic, though. Oh, no. But I we haven't been really taking that much damage with our purse now. Uh, let's go ahead and collect the toxic berries, because we have to. There's no other way. We're starving. Rose Clan is starving to death. And then how is our berry now? Are you doing okay, little one? Oh, and look at Bladehorn! <gasps> Bladehorn is now an adult. We can go ahead and change your name to Bladehorn Paw, since you are a young little adult right now. That is so exciting. And then Spruce Kit is also an adult, too. So you can be Spruce Paw. 
and then let's see who else do we need to change wing flight how long do you have you have five days left i kind of want you and honeypaw to have your baby uh so hopefully we can figure out the food situation <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and collect some of these pokey berries and then blade horn i think you're gonna have to come this way since we have all those termites over on this side of the area uh like over here yeah oh and there's a tree too mm, i wonder if that would be a good place to uh have some of our nichelings all right so spruce paw what can you do i wish it would rain if it rained that we would have more food uh let's see let's go ahead and collect the bugs that are right there thank goodness for bug collecting and then wing flight uh just move there for now and then we are all out of moves for now. At least we found some toxic berries. I wonder how much this poison debuff is going to hurt our little nichelings. I think it might be a little bit bugged since we are in the sandbox texture branch. Because our nichelings haven't been taking that much damage. So, or maybe their purse now is just really good because I kind of upped the healing ability for our nichelings in sandbox mode. So, let's go ahead and see what happens. Okay, and then you are poisoned, but it doesn't look like you're taking any damage right now. All right, so at least we can attempt to collect some more of these berries. There we go. And then Fuzzy Heart, you are going to need to collect that too. And since Thornstar has passed away, we need a new Nishling to be the leader of our clan. We have Honey Paw, Fuzzy Heart, we have Bee Heart, ooh, I think Bee Heart would look at this little one, little oak kit, and look at our pregnant belly and say, I need to protect my clan and do whatever it takes. I think little Bee Heart will now become Bee Star. And become the leader of the clan just like her father. So little bee star, you are now the clan leader. Hopefully you can lead your little nichelings and collect enough food so we don't starve to death because we're having some issues right now. Hopefully the rain will come. Oh my goodness. A uh, little oak kit, you can come over here and pop right there. And there's a little wandering nicheling, little amber here. You're so cute. We can't even think about adding any more nichelings right now. We need food. Need food. Okay, little spruce paw. Let's go ahead and collect uh, some of these berries. And then no bugs right there. And you can go ahead and attempt to collect some of those. There we go. And blade horn. Uh, I want you to come over here by your mom. And oh, there's some bugs. <gasps> nice, you can go ahead and collect some bugs. That's awesome. All right, so we're getting some more food. And I think Beastar uh, would want to have her kit very, very soon. <laughs> uh, so hopefully we can get enough food for that. So let's go ahead and move to the next day. And there's another Barina. Oh my goodness, how many Barinas are going to just like pop out? and uh, try to mess with us. All right, so Bladehorn, let's go ahead and start fighting. We are going to have to. And let's see, do we have enough? Oh, I don't know if they can get over in time. It might be better. Oh no, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, so this needs to be cracked open. Why don't you come over here and crack this? So Wing Flight can go ahead and collect these bugs. And then Spruce Paw. Hmm. Why don't you go ahead and do your healing ability? And then Little Bee Star would probably do what she could to fight this Baryuna too. To protect Little Oak Kit and to protect her pregnant belly. And then you guys. Let's see how much. Uh. uh okay. I guess we should come over here if we can. Uh, let's see. Are we gonna make it? Uh, no. Okay, but we'll make it in the next turn if we can help fight this Barina. So let's go ahead and see what happens. Oh, we're taking some damage. Hopefully you're okay. 
with the purse now. Okay, so it looks like everything's fine with that. Are you sickly, Amber? Are you gonna get everybody sick? You have eye immunity? Oh my goodness, you're gonna give everybody the cold, aren't you? All right, so you are bleeding, but it doesn't look like you're taking damage. Yeah, it must be a bug or something with the sandbox mode, but we'll go ahead and lick you. And let's go ahead and fight this Barina. There we go. And then fight, fight, fight. <gasps> we did it, perfect. So Fuzzy Heart will come over here and collect this up. And now we should get a ton of food from doing that. And hopefully that defender bear doesn't come and try to eat us. <laughs> and then, oh, look, there's a little bunny in the nest. Oh, that's so cute. And then over here, we can go ahead and attempt to collect these berries, I guess. Hopefully we can get some more food soon. There we go. All right. So let's go ahead and change the day. And then, is this our friendly Barina? It is! A <gasps> friendly Barina is gonna pass away soon! Oh no! I think it was, who was it? Honey. Honeypaw is carrying the Barina's child. And I think since the Barina is gonna pass away soon, ooh, should we try to have an, two? I don't know if we'll have enough time. I really don't. Oh my goodness. It's hard because we're running out of food. I wasn't watching the food as good as I should have. And we got into a really bad situation. Uh, with all this so let's just go ahead and come over here collect some more of the berries and B star I think you want to have your baby soon don't you so let's come over here pop down your nest there we go a little blade horn uh, why don't you start walking over here so you can go get those termite mounds so maybe that will help us with our food situation so you're going over there, and the little oak kit, why don't you stay by our clan leader, B-Star. And then back over here, we have Wing Flight. Oh no, <gasps> Wing Flight! Oh no! Wing Flight is going to pass away, and B-Star is about to have his child. <gasps> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Well, I mean, you are blind, so... I guess technically you couldn't see your child anymore. That's so sad. I shouldn't say that. Oh my goodness, but you are. Oh, you're never going to meet your last child. Oh no, I'm so sorry. We had a food problem and I was scrounging up berries, all the berries that I could. Oh my goodness. And then we're out of moves. Rest in peace, Wing Flight. What? Rest in peace. Oh no. And that little spruce paw is all alone over here. But we do have another little Nishling baby. A precious little daughter. Little Fern. Hold on, can I? There we go. Little Fern. Right there. She has a little bat face. Just like her father. And no paw. No wing, though. But she did inherit her father's little deformed paw, though. Oh my goodness, precious little fern. Little fern kit. You're so adorable, little one. You're so adorable. Oh my goodness. Do you, wait, do you have your... Oh, do we have the bat wing in her recessive trait? Oh no, we don't. Oh no, did we lose our bat wing? Wait, what about, um... What about blade horn? Do you have it? <gasps> they don't have it. Oh no. Oh no. Maybe one day we'll find... The bat wings again, hopefully. Hopefully one day. Oh my goodness. Alright, so let's go ahead and do some more food collecting. There we go. We should be getting into a good place now with our food. Oh no. Can I not reach that one? No! <laughs> oh my goodness. What do we do? I guess you'd just be like upset and like try to bat at it or something. Or maybe we should try to fight some of these bunnies or rabbles because uh, we need food. I'm just scared about that defender bear. But we are kind of desperate right now. We're desperate for food. Oh, can you whack at it? No, we're going to have to go have someone come over here and help you with this. Uh, let's see. Okay, can you come over here? And I guess you'll have to help him whack at it in the next turn. 
then B-star, why don't you clear up some of this nesting area? And then poor little spruce paw, you are all alone over here. Uh, let's go ahead and collect those. Okay, we are out of moves. And our tribe is dwindling, but our food is going up. So we'll have to do what we have to do for now. So let's go ahead and see what the next day brings. And there we go. So yeah, it doesn't look like we're getting poisoned. So that's pretty good. And then Fuzzy Heart, you only have six days left too. We're, I don't know where that little nicheling went. That nicheling with the scorpion tail. I don't even know what happened to her. Hmm. I wonder if... Let's see. We can find another mate for Fuzzy Heart. Maybe Honey Paw? She's currently pregnant with the Barina's child. Let's see. What are their immunities like? I don't think they're going to be a good mix. Let's see. E and A and E and A. But they might try for it. Just because he doesn't have a lot of time left and we need to have a mate for him if we want our tribe to grow and to survive. Unless we can find where that little scorpion tail nicheling went. Oh no. There's that little uh, defender bear is like way over there. So I wonder if we start hitting those uh, little rabbles if the defender bear will come and like fight us over there. I'm not too sure. But we might try it. So Spruce Paw, why don't you go ahead and collect that for now? And B Star, why don't you pop out of the nest? Oh wait, B Star! Oh, your mate passed away. Let's see, you have E and B though. What are there? You have E and A. So it's not perfect, but it's a little bit better than Honey Paw. I wonder if Fuzzy Heart and B Star would have more children because her mate passed away. And I think Fuzzy Heart really wants to have some children of his own? Oh, I don't know. And then Bladehorn, H, you have E and H. Hmm. Not really good for anything. <laughs> oh gosh, okay. We're having some issues. We'll figure it out though. I have faith. Oh no, you can't hit it, can you? Let's see. Let's go ahead and have Fuzzy Heart come over here so you can crack open this. And then... Who are you? A rogue male. Wait, did you get B-Star pregnant? No. Oh gosh, B-Star. Be careful. <laughs> you may have a rogue male's child. <laughs> uh, no. No. Leave me alone. Alright, there we go. We're gonna have to be careful with that. <laughs> and then Fuzzy Heart. Go ahead and collect that grass. And then Honey Paw. I want you to have your baby too. Okay, let's go ahead and collect this food and then maybe we'll have a couple babies soon. Oh my goodness, little fern kit, you're so cute. I love you, you look like a little squirrel. You're still adorable. All right, so there we go, the next turn. And they're having some termite problems, but it doesn't seem to be harming us. So everything is a-okay, I guess, over there. And then honey paw. Go ahead and collect these toxic berries. And there should be another termite mound somewhere over here. Right? Oh, what's this? A peaceful bear. Oh my gosh, there's a peaceful bear over here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's come have you come over here. And then Bladehorn. Uh, oh, you did it. Good job, Bladehorn. Go ahead and collect those termites. And then little fern kit. We'll pop you up here next to this goofy looking bear holy crap you are goofy looking i think b star would be like hey now you're an all-star just kidding um and then oak kit oh you're growing up little one let's go ahead and have you get those grasses and then we have little spruce paw over here why don't you collect those berries and then Move you over here, start collecting. Oh, there's a little bunny. I wonder, should we start fighting? Should we start trying to get food from uh, these little bundles and stuff? Oh, I don't know. Let's go ahead and see what the next turn is going to bring our tribe. And let's see, toxic berries. 
toxic berries. I think Honeypaw is getting antsy to have her baby. And I think Beastar... Ooh, should we have Fuzzy Heart? I think Fuzzy Heart and Beastar would want to have a baby too together. Even though they don't have the best immunity genes, I think they'd risk it for the biscuit. And they would attempt to have a child together too. I think so. So we're gonna go ahead and pop down a nest for them. And also pop down a nest for Honeypaw. And... Let's see, blade, horn, go ahead and collect the bugs that are right here. And then fuzzy heart, why don't you clear, ooh, you gotta lick his wounds too. Clear out some of this area too. Fuzzy heart, you're gonna be a dad. Oh my goodness. And then little fern kit, let's go ahead and move you up here. And then oak kit, let's go ahead and move you over here so you can help with these toxic berry situation. And then we have spruce paw. Who, I guess maybe you should leave this area if this berry bush isn't gonna be active right now. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and start moving you over this way a little bit because I feel bad that you're all alone and there's not really that much use for you over there. All right, we're about to have two new nichelings join our tribe. I hope it's an okay decision. I know we're running low on food again, but our nichelings are getting older, and I really want to make sure that we have enough nichelings. And, oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at you! Oh no, are you sickly? Adder! Little adder, oh my goodness. Look at you! You're so cute and so adorable. I love you. You are sickly. You have double E immunity. Oh no. Hopefully with our purse not though, our healing ability will help you out a lot. And then we have another little one over here. Uh, let's see. You have Berina Claw! And you have the Berina Snout too. That'll be very interesting. So we have a little puddle. Little puddle kit. Oh, you're so cute, puddle. Oh my goodness. Little half Berina little baby. That is so fun. And then Adder, we can go ahead and give you at our kit. There we are. Oh my goodness. So I hope that B Star and her remaining days can be a good leader for her clan as we hear these growls in the distance. And I hope we will be able to get enough berries so we are no longer starving and get enough bugs. I hope the warrior bats are going to be okay. But we'll have to see and check in on them in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in another episode. Bye!